Okay everyone, hope you enjoyed that. This is how to drive a manual car. A little bit about me. My name is Jared Evans, a fellow graduate student here at Liberty. I've been driving stick shift since I was 15. It's what I learned to drive on. I've always found that it was hard for people to learn how to drive it. So, sit back, enjoy the ride, and I will try to teach it to you in three easy steps. The first being, familiarize yourself with your ride. And uh, a lot of people don't know this, but they should um, already learn how to drive stick. Most come in five speeds or six speeds, like mine personally. And uh, let's take a look at mine. So here we have the clutch, which is important for, um, you know, obviously changing gears. And then next we have the brake. And obviously the next is the gas pedal. So obviously those are the three components in your floorboard. Moving on up to here, we have the gear shift on the left, and then to the right is the e-brake. These are both very important components when it comes to uh, changing gears in your manual transmission. Okay, moving on to the next step, which is practice, practice, practice. And enough of this cannot be said as uh, you know, we can do things like stalling out and such when learning how to drive a manual. This first clip I'm going to be showing you is uh, the feet motions. And basically, when you learn where your gears are, you're basically going to be pressing the clutch down when you're getting into a gear and then pushing up on the gas while letting off the clutch. So there it shows as if you were changing into a gear and as the gas is moving down, you're coming off the clutch, boom, change a gear come off go on the gas let's see how it looks on the hands so obviously you have to familiarize yourself I showed at the beginning the five and six speeds and this is basically what you do with your hands while you're changing it with your feet so third step is relax obviously you have to be calm to drive manuals it takes a lot of practice and let's see how it should look in real life So obviously we've got the clutch down going into first now giving it some gas letting off the clutch going into second after the foot was put it down on the clutch third give it some gas going into fourth give it some gas let off the clutch clutch down going into fifth it is also important to note that usually you switch around three rpms and the e-brake is used for parking and you want to make sure you put it in at least first gear when the e-brake is up to park and that is all, folks. Um, I hope that this short little video can help you on your journey to learning how to drive a manual. Thank you very much. Goodbye.